The executive yuan on Sunday requested a one-year extension of the special COVID-19 relief act and its special budget, of which 130 billion NT is still unspent. The extension request has fueled speculation that another round of stimulus vouchers could come. In response, Premier Su Zhenzhang says the government will allocate funds based on how the COVID situation unfolds. While attending a regional revitalization forum, Premier Su Zhenzhang explained why his cabinet had requested an extension of the special COVID-19 relief act by another year to June 30, 2023. Considering how the pandemic is unfolding, we think it warrants an extension of the budget to be spent. There's still around 130 billion NT. The reason there are still funds left has to do with the fact that we've kept the situation relatively stable. True, it is necessary to some extent. From our current observations, we could extend the budget's implementation period, but there is probably no need to allocate additional funds. With this in mind, the DPP caucus will fully support the executive yuan's request and propose an extension of the Special Relief Act. Countering COVID is still the most important task, but if there are more work that can be done, we could help the tourism, hotel and restaurant sectors, which were hit extremely hard over the last two years under the pandemic. Amid rising COVID numbers, ruling and opposition lawmakers have voiced support for an extension, with 130 billion NT still left unused from the original 839 billion NT budget, will it all go toward revitalization programs? As for whether there is another round of stimulus or relief measures, that all depends on how the epidemic pans out. By our current assessment, there is probably no need for more stimulus vouchers. If there are still funds left from the special budget or if relevant authorities deem it necessary, we hope to provide relief to the tourism industry, both domestic and international, or the hotel and the restaurant sector. I think we could allocate funds to those areas. The focus now should be on epidemic prevention. To discuss relief measures is not only unrealistic, but also too hasty. Legislator Hong Mong Kai said epidemic prevention should take priority over relief measures as a pandemic rages on.